I know the lighting isn't good in here, but I just um, dropped my boyfriend off at his car and I'm gonna get my eyebrows done. They are in need. They're basically a unibrow now. So I'm at the mall and then after that, I'm gonna go home and record a video. So let's go get these eyebrows done. We are in Charlotte Ruth for now and I'm just looking at like the t-shirts and stuff. And then I want this shirt because this is me. Extra. We are now home, but I'm gonna go wake up my sisters because they are really lazy, like super lazy, it's insane. <gasps> Say hi. Hi. Say hi, ugly. I'm just kidding. Hi, mama. You gotta get to work. That's my brother. Sleeping. What's up? Sleeping. Hola, bolita. And then another one, sleeping. <laughs> No, I'm, I want to do a pink with a black uh, lip makeup look today. So first, I'm going to start off with some Baby Skin Instant Pore Eraser. So this is a drugstore primer, and um, it's pretty cheap, but it works really well. If I don't use this, I use Smashbox. Okay, so now that our primer is on, I'm going to go ahead and put foundation on. So I'm going to use the Maybelline Pro Matte Foundation in the color 105, which is natural beige. I'm going to shake it. And then I'm going to dot it all over half of my face because for me, this uh, foundation dries up too fast on my skin. And I'm going to use a beauty, beauty blender. In this case, this is from Real Techniques. That's it. And I'm going to dot it all over the other side of my face. So my eyebrows, I'm going to do off camera and then later on I'll do a video on how I do my eyebrows. So eyebrows done. So now I'm going to do eyeshadow and I want to do a pink eyeshadow. So I'm going to use um, the BH Cosmetics Blush Neutral. So it has 26 color eyeshadows and blush palettes. So these are the blushes and today I'm going to be using this pink. Okay, so now so now I'm going to start using the pink eyeshadow, which I think is cool. And I want to put that all over the lid. So for the crease, I'm going to use the color right next to it right here with a fluffy brush like this. This brush, I stole it from my sister, so honestly, I don't know where she got it. So now that the um, creases are done, I'm going to start getting that pink eyeshadow and putting it all up on my lid. For this, I'm just going to use a BH Cosmetics brush, just like a flathead brush. <laughs> I'm excited. Put some water on my brush just so I could pick up the color a little bit more. So now I'm going to um, use the Urban Decay Electric Palette and I'm going to use that uh, pink, that hot pink as well on the same brush. See how it's brightening up the lid a little bit more? So now taking that same fluffy brush we used with um, this color right here, I'm just going to blend out the uh, sides of the pink.
Bueno. ¿Quieres una dona de azúcar? Ya. Yeah. Órale, pues, ¿quieres algo para esto? Ah, uh, no, es que okay. aquí no está. Ah, órale, pues. Ok. Bye. Bye. So now with another clean fluffy brush, I'm going to take um, 1987 from the Gwen Stefani and the Urban Decay collection. I'm just going to put it in the crease. So now on top of the pink, I'm going to pack on from the Carly Bible palette this cute shimmery pink. Just like we give some... Uh, shimmer to it. Yes, there's a lot of fallout, but we'll clean that up with concealer and stuff. So for the um, eyebrows, I'm going to use the Carly Bible palette as well, but I'm going to use this shimmery right here. And I'm going to blend it in with the same brush. For, for concealer, I'm going to use the Tarte Shape Tape in the color Light Medium. So now with the damp sponge, I'm just going to blend all of that in. Okay, so now I'm going to uh, set the concealer. So I'm going to um, get my, sorry, Airspun Loose Face Powder. And this shit smells like heaven. Okay, so now I'm just going to take the same brush, and then on one side, I'm going to put the powder. And with the other side, I'm going to uh, damp it first, and then put the powder so there's no creases. So I look up when I do this. So for the inner corners, I'm going to go in with the same uh, color I went in to highlight my upper brow. So it's this one right here from the Carly palette. For my lower lash line, I kind of want to do a blue. I don't know why, but I'm feeling a blue. So I'm going to take this uh, Real Technique brush, a detailing brush, and I'm going to, um, I don't know what blue. I'm going to take this light blue for the inner and then for like the middle part, I guess, and then this black blue for the outer part. And then we'll see how it looks. I'm getting too excited. So now I'm going to set my face with the BH Studio Pro Powder. And this is in the shade 230. So this one right here. And I'm going to use um, the Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Kit in light to medium. I'm going to use this shade right here.
and then I'm gonna do my forehead. With anything I have left, I usually just use it for my nose, like on the sides of my nose. Okay, so now I'm gonna bake using that same um, powder. I was trying to find this. And I'm gonna take out one of these. I found this in my mom's bathroom when I took it. I know you can get these at like the 99 cent store in like a bag. And that's probably what I have to do today. Cause these come in handy when you're baking. That's it. I just slide it over. Beautiful line. So while that's baking, I'm going to go ahead and do blush. And for blush, I'm just going to use this uh, BH Cosmetics brush, I mean, blush palette. And I'm probably just, and I'm going to use this one right here mixed with a little bit of this pink one. Because, you know, it's a pink eye. So you need some pink blush. all out with highlight because highlight is like the reason I do my makeup to be honest is for highlight so I'm gonna use a Carly Bible palette and I'm gonna use this like rose gold right here if you guys didn't know she has another palette but it's just the Carly Bible palette this one's the Carly Bible deluxe palette and so a lot of her uh, fans that were using it used this one right here as a highlight but it was originally an eyeshadow so she read our comments she Knew what we wanted, so she made that little eyeshadow into a highlight, which I love about Carly. Okay, so now that's done, I'm just going to do mascara and then we'll take off this bake. So for mascara, I'm just using a Tarte uh, mascara called Man Eater. I got this with the eyeliner, and I really like the eyeliner. I haven't done eye uh, wing eye in forever, and that one's just super helpful. And I'm going to put mascara on my lower lash line as well. Alright, and now we're going to take off this bake with a brush. So I'm just using this brush, and I also stole this brush from my sister, but she got it from Best Stop. Best Stop? When I blend, I usually blend from up to down, just so like none of this goes up there. So for lips, I'm using the Jeffree Star Liquid Lipsticks in the color Weirdo. And on the center of the lip, I'm going to add um, that pink that we used for our lids, just with my finger. So I really like this look. I honestly wouldn't wear this on an everyday basis. This is just something fun that I had in my mind that I wanted to get out. I really like it with this um, shirt that I got from Rome Wee. I would probably wear this look maybe like at a crazy concert or something, but rarely go to those. But yeah, this is the look. So I hope you guys like this video that I made. Um, I know I haven't posted in a long ass time, but now that I got a camera and I got some editing stuff going on, I'm probably going to be posting more vlogs and makeup videos and whatever you guys want to see. Maybe like my school at FITM. But yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Bye!